here we are, Lisa Waitman here at the Sydney Morning Herald Half Marathon. Congratulations, first of all, getting the win today. Totally different experience to a lot of the races that I've ran, where they've been flat and you get a bit of a rhythm, whereas here it was just not knowing what to expect. One minute you're up and then you're going down and yeah, so it was a good strength run and an opportunity to just test yourself and see what you can do. How, how was your run? Uh, pretty happy, you can always complain about coming first, I think for sure. Now, other thing you've been is first female of the, the Aussie women on the plane to Rio for the marathon and it's a big celebration and we'd like to present you with your very own Brazilian flag, but how does it feel to be on another Olympic team? Uh, it feels amazing. I guess when I was young, if I had thought that I was going to go to the Olympics, I would have fainted if anyone told me that. So uh, with all my injuries and everything, all my setbacks, but uh, yeah, it's good to go to my third and I can't wait. Excellent. Now you're going to see a bit of this guy. This is the mascot. His name is Vinny. I like Vinny. Any idea what it is? No idea. Not sure. But I love stuffed animals. Cool. Sure they tell me it's sort of part cat, part monkey. It's a collection of all the animals in Brazil, the native yeah. animals. So, um, Vinicius or Vinny. And here's the hat, which you can also put on. So, whack that on as well. And now you've been anointed. fully <laughs> rio -ified. And of course, you've got to have your very own Get Mossy and Robo to Rio pin, in. which is limited edition. So, uh, have you been to Rio before? I have not. Okay. No, very good. Anything you're in particular looking forward to other than running in the marathon on the 14th of August? Bit of sun. Bit of sun. Bit of sun is good. Very nice. Got a, uh, definitely taking a bit of sun, I'm sure, after the marathon. Speaking of sun and suns, are you taking your son? No, no, he'll be home. He'll be getting spoiled by his uh, grandparents. Very good. And I think he'll be second. He can stay up till 10.30 and watch you on the night. And I think he'll be very, very good. All right, <laughs> go, go Pete. And uh, well done and go Lisa. Thanks for having a chat with us. Thanks. There we go.